I think of Solomon. He said this, Hear counsel, receive instruction, that thou mayest be wise in the end. Another thing that I think of a lot of times, men, is I'm challenging young men to find older men and say, go to them and say, I need help. I want to grow. Ask questions. You can learn from people that have gone before so we don't repeat the mistakes. And I, I sat down in my quiet time and I wrote down some questions I want to share with you, man. And I hope that you'll listen to these questions because they might help you in relationship building, in growing in instruction and wisdom. And I hope it's a tool that you can use because I just think they're powerful. The first question is this, what character trait in my life do you think I could pray about and work on? Well, that would be a great one for a child to ask their parents. And then ask God to show you what that character trait is. And it might be interesting when they say to you, it's integrity, and you're going, wow, why would they say integrity? I don't lie. I've always been honest with my parents. I always pay what I'm supposed to pay. But maybe they said integrity, and when you ask them, they'll tell you, because they don't know if they can trust you because you talk bad about other people. So there's an integrity issue there, and you can't see it. So you might need their help also when they identify it, why they might have said what they said. In relationship building, when you uh, have a struggle with someone, someone has offended you and they've wronged you and you're saying, what do I say when I see those people again? A great question is seeing if God has been working in their life and they're ready to be honest and open with you is, do you believe everything is right between you and me? Just a simple question. And how they respond will give you the opportunity whether God wants you to pursue those things in that relationship that need healing or whether he's prepared them or not. Here's a great question. Have I done anything in our relationship that has given you a reason not to trust me? Is there anything that I have done in our relationship that would give you reason not to trust me? And here is probably one of the most difficult questions we could ask someone and really test where we are in a friendship is, do you believe our relationship is strong enough that we would receive correction, reproof, or instruction from one another? You know, I want to help this person, but it's going to mean something that might be hard. Well, ask them the question. Do you think our relationship is strong enough? I hope these things help you and I experience this thing called wisdom, instruction, and growing in it. God bless you.